Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 17. Today we're on Blake Farms. Your host, well if not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, today, today we're going to be harvesting field 18, but it's not, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. I've uh, been up since, I've been up since 5, but I started work at 6, me and Colin. And, uh, well... We did some field work, got things ready, uh, we still got feed animals. I got nosting. We are out of milk, so it's time to sell the honey milk, so here's what we're fixing to do. Cross our fingers. Um, oh yeah, I forgot, gotta get closer on this. I have to almost be at the door. But I noticed some guys over here have been doing some work to our area. Uh, they weren't supposed to start that yet. But, oh, there's our unload symbol. And there we go. I got money. Money rolling in. But it uh, looks like they uh, expanded the driveway here, or the parking lot. Cut down some trees and expanded it. And it looks like they cleared up down through there. So I don't know. They wasn't supposed to start that project yet without me, so anyway, I'm glad they did. But, uh, yeah, we gotta do this. We gotta feed the animals. Start 18. Hopefully here pretty soon. Waiting on the dude to dry. Alright, they gave us, um, $73,628. Needed a whole lot more money, but Hey, that's 73000 we didn't have. Alright, we, we gotta take another little trip. Uh, for those greenhouses, folks, here's the st selling stands for them. The first one here and the second one. Um, it's gonna be a real fun job figuring out which one goes to which mod. And I guess when we drive across, we'll know, huh? Um... Yeah, I, I've been trying to get the, my frames per second out of view since everybody knows I only get like 8 to 12 frames per second. And, and it's just, it's about to slow down here in the shop yard. But uh, I guess I want to meet y'all when I get to the factories and uh, I'll see you there, okay? Alright, I just want to come back a little early. I just want to say, look at our beans, how they're growing. They're really turning green, folks. We need a rain on them, but we need to get the crops out of the ground, too. Alright, we're going to slow down here. But, uh, we got to get this, uh, digestate from these factories up back here. And then uh, go to the cows, get that, and then go to pigs, pick up that slurry, which I, they should all mix together in the same tank. And then take that down to the farm, main farm. But while we're at the cows, we're going to feed them, so uh, I'm going to get this one here just to show y'all. Um... We have to have a trailer down here. Uh, I'm going to bring our bobcat from the cows down here, but we got to have a trailer or something. You're high enough to dump in that. Oh, I'm not backing straight like I'm supposed to. But uh, our manure dumps in the greenhouses there along with water. But we're going to have to have something, a uh, front loader like the bobcat. Oh, Mr. Blue can't back. Hang on, folks. I got to concentrate here. Apparently, I can't back and talk. But anyway, we're going to take this digestate to the cows. Finish loading the cows out. Or, you know, cows digestate on this tank. There we go. 42,262 liters. That's the worst one. This one over here, we can just drive by. But uh, I want to give a shout out. Go ahead and give a shout out. The greenhouses ain't ready yet for them. But um, 
Oh, I hit the curve there. I want to give a shout out to one more, please. Pimpkin, this is your time to shine. I want to insert a little clip right now. What do you think about that, folks? That's uh, Pimpkin, the famous bunny, or famous in my book anyway. Uh, we're going to be growing tomatoes and strawberries for them, and uh, we just got to get going. We got 84,237 off the factories. Uh, manure is quite a bit in there, too. Uh, this factory or greenhouse here, pallets will come out and load on it, strip right there. But uh, we have to have the bobcat down here, or, or yeah, the bobcat, Rogers ACB, skid steer, one to the other, get them off. So, uh, but anyway, uh, I'm gonna do a jump cut here and I will meet y'all at the cow farm, uh, when I go feed, feed them. Okay, be back in just a second. Alright, I just got back then. We're at 84,237. Brought us to 94,879. So not bad on that. I think that's most this truck ever had in it. And, uh, not wanting to turn. Quite a bit of weight there. This tanker, uh oh, can I even get through this way? I forgot I loaded the bobcat on the trailer. But, uh, yeah, this trailer is meant for a Kentucky truck. Ooh. All right, I already got this set up to go to the pigs. So drive course, stop at the last point. I have fun. Who, who's in there, by the way? Uh, Bart's Video 573. Thank you, brother, for coming out and driving the truck for me. We're going to get over here in the old New Holland here. 23,000 left in here. Oop, got to raise that up. Now I forgot our uh, <laughs> little robots in there. I'm just going to pull through the door right here if I can. Just enough to... Yeah, Betsy, I'm coming. Actually, it shows I can unload right there, but I know that ain't right. And I knew that wasn't going to work. Got to be over more. It's kind of hard to do it with the forks on there. Now, let me try. Oh, yeah, much better. Am I unloading on the right side? I yeah, see. Tip side left, that'd be right, so. And they are low, folks. They are low. Going to need a grass bale, look like, here pretty soon. Alright, that's not going to take very long. And we are empty. Now what am I hanging on? Oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta, I gotta turn a little bit when I go out backwards. Uh oh. A am I stuck? Like really? I I'm going to have to pull out. Huh? <laughs> well, folks, we ain't got time as well as we're just going to leave that right there. Betsy, it's a, a bubba is going to just have to wait. I'm sorry. You can still eat. Okay? Okay. Damn, huh? Uh -uh. Alright. And don't you back talk me. Alright, we gotta get to our, uh... No, we don't need our bees. I did put some more wood back in this, and, but we, we gotta get a couple more of these bee houses, but we can't right now because we don't have enough money. Uh, this is one thing I want to show y'all. Kind of laggy. Ain't been down here yet. 
what I done was uh come on now there we go I dropped the corn heads there moved the ripper over there and the mower over there and that man Colin got ripping this up this morning and uh, we got to right there he done the fertilizing I done the ripping but uh, I got up at 6 o'clock this morning and started moving equipment around. I'm like, you know, rain's coming. We're going to have to get busy. We got some equipment put in the sheds. We got the uh, palletizer in there. We had a fertilizer buggy in there, but didn't do that yet. Don't hit the truck. Don't Oh, don't hit the barn. Oh, that was close. That was close, folks. Yeah, what I'm gonna do is get these, uh, get somebody on the, uh, what is it, 9RX? Or 9RT or whatever it's called. I, I don't know what it's called. I can't, I forgot. Alright, we got that hooked up. Let's shut that off right now. 9RT, 2014 model. But we got the, uh, ripper hooked up. Oh good, our Peterbilt has reached destination. Alright, where was I? Oh yeah. Um, who we have here? AG Baby Girl Vows driving our 9R T. Doing a good job plowing. Um, yeah, uh, we fertilize all this. Uh, well, I said we call and fertilize. Um, yeah, I had to do some till 7, but after 7, he took over. Where, where is the buggy? Oh, there it is. I'm way on down here. I'm going to grab this, get it going, and then uh, we'll get back to our Peterbilt, get him situated. Alright, we're just going to hire a worker for this guy. No explaining. Uh, we got right at 4500 left fertilize uh seven stars gonna be driving this all right seven stars yeah i want to apologize for the interruption folks uh see a stop driver here we really gotta oh gotta start the engine first really gotta get our cows back i mean our pigs back i'm sorry we still got our cows don't we we still got our cows um, whoa, I gotta watch where I'm going to. Uh oh, uh oh, I've got, I've got the bailer in the truck here waiting. This is literally, I need to shut that door so the birds won't get in there after that bird, after the pig food. I've been doing some missions on that field right there. Uh, I got Peter Wood maxed out. Um, that means we can't get his prices no lower. He said buy them or uh, keep doing the missions, but he ain't going no lower. So I'm like, okay, well, I just got to get the money first. And let's see, cow farm to main farm when we leave here. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. I'm going to straighten up a little bit. Start cutting the other way too soon. Trying to miss a ditch and uh, go towards the pit too. I think it's just more of a drop off. Almost there. There we go. Alright, we got that. Just to double check, make sure. Uh, liquid manure on both cows and pigs are done. I wish sheep had some. But animals are good, except for the cows. Just need some grass, but we'll take care of that tomorrow. Or oh, while it's raining. So now, I got a bit of a dilemma. I, I gotta get this to the main farm. Oh, make it, make it, make it. And uh, our combine's in the way when this guy's go pulls in, so. It's always something, right? I'm gonna get right up here. I'm gonna drive course. 
I have a feeling it's going to start raining as soon as we get to the field. I hope not. Try to do missions on these two fields, but just stop at the last trigger. But uh, they're not ready yet. Uh, let's see. I don't get back to our combine. Get him started up and warmed up. We might be able to do this. But uh, follow me on that. And this is Colin Julian. Thank you, brother, for coming out during drain court. Uh, we got this guy emptied. Uh, let's see, start engine first. Yeah, I knew that. I knew that. Not in range. Been having problems. Not in range. That's when they're sitting all funny. I wonder if it'll range at. Really? I can't get no closer. Man, I'm just going to have to leave that in there for a second, I guess. Oh, he's here. Come on, stop him. Why stop him? Uh, stop, driver. I need to make a new course so he'll go around the other driveway. Since we're already in him, let's go ahead and go around. I just don't understand why that one won't hook up to anything it's been doing. Unless uh, that eight R is not fallable. Some of them are like that. And I forgot to put the new mod in here, but y'all will be seeing that when we start canola. We are going to be able to make straw bales out of canola straw now. Um. You can thank Dagrin for that. Uh, go to his channel. It should be the recent video. Uh, yes, folks. Uh, apparently, over in the UK, they make straw out of canola stubbles that's left. Uh, I did not know that, but do now. Uh, not yet. Let's see. Is it back here? I've been doing it from the front. Let me back up. Just don't think I'm close enough. Okay, I, I, I give up. I really give up. Okay, we're gonna come back later. We gotta get our combine down the road. Uh, seven stars is uh, going on town fertilizing. Let's try uh, this dude one more time on the follow me. I just I don't understand that either. We're going to show his motor off. And go ahead and get the combine going. We're going to turn flashers on or rotors on. And let's go to field 18. The dude should be off the uh, off the leaves and stuff now. Am I going to hit the mailbox? I just ran. Oh, okay. Real life, that would have been a, a trash mailbox. Uh, who we got? Colin. Colin Jr. Vlogs, folks. Down below in the description. Uh, Seven Stars, AG, Baby Girl, Val. All of them are down below in the description. He is almost done there. 17% um, fertilized left. I doubt if he'll have enough. I really do. But we got more in the shed. We got actually plenty of fertilizer in the shed. 
Uh, it'll probably take all of it to fill that thing up on. We need to, uh, we got some manure. When we get closer to the shop, we'll spray those fields with manure when we get down that way. Alright, turn my right blinker on. Well, it shuts the rest of them off. Which I could have just left all of them on, but. Okay, turn my hazards back on. Made it around that mailbox, and we are good to go. Um, we are going to bail some bales now because our straw. <laughs> get down here, I'll show you our straw. We got like 600,000 liters of straw down over by our plant area. Loose straw. And that's not counting what's in the uh, factories. That's just the, what we got in storage down there. Alright, so I hook up on the the left side, or some people call it the driver's side, so question is where to park I actually think I'm on to whoa mailbox thank goodness I missed it uh, I don't think the, the ditch is very deep down here so I'm going down this thing's got ooh ooh got back on the highway a little bit shoulder drops off a little bit there alright let's pull in here here's where the new road's going to be anyway uh, whoa that's deep that is deep please don't damage the combine no other header. I would have hit the deepest part right there. Let's see, I'm going to stop him on the uh, highway to hold up traffic for me. Alright. Uh, detach. I love an automatic detaching. Which I don't know. Uh, any of y'all know or, or heard of it, but I heard over. Uh, like UK and stuff, they do have automatic attachers on their tongues. Uh, you can flip a switch and it closes the latch. That's the funny looking latches, like the, the circle shaped ones. Alright, let's go in cab, see if I can get this baby to line up this right. I'm crooked, I know, but there, oh. There we go, it's crooked, but it worked, so let's fold our header. Alright, we already unfolded there, so start. Uh, the header is folded. Okay, I did not do that that time. Okay, I just did that. Fold it back. Um. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to, uh. Come on, unfold. I reset the game, because, uh. Yeah, okay. Now I'm going to fold the header back. Put that back on that. Wait, 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 wait. I, I see. Where am I? Why is that folding? Still said header, though. Finally. 
Finally. Now right, let's let's go to town here. Alright, this is barley. And we should be making swaths. Alright. And of course, I'm going to get a, a GPS here. Always got to have my GPS. Let's go ahead and turn those beacons off and hazards off. We'll make a, a pass around the whole thing. And then uh, we'll start a hired worker. Actually, let that dump the straw out. We're going to go ahead and start a hired worker now because we got to get the Arger wagon off. Hope these folks don't mind me going out in there yard like that. I used to hate farmers when they done that. They have all that field and all of a sudden they just pull out in the yard like that. Yeah, hire a worker. Yeah. He wants to go that way, we'll let him go that way. I'll set you on going around. Alright, have fun. Down the steps I go. Oh, you're fixing to dust me. Alright, let's get him off the highway. Where'd he go? Birch Radio, well, oh, I'll just show you Birch Radio 573 is driving the combine. Wasn't he on something I go? I thought he was on something I go. Now, right, here's the actual part of the drive. But, folks, uh, that right down through there, we're going to build this up here and we're going to put a road going back to our part of the factory and still have them drive through theirs. All right, we're going. Huh. I guess we could have went and rode along with uh, Colin there, or I mean Birch Radio Five Seven Three. He's driving the combine now. Could have done a ride along because that whole field probably will fit in it. Yeah, let's see, let's get our uh, twelve percent though. We might have to haul out a little bit. But, um. Oh, Lordy. Yeah, we got that mess to take care of. Um. We'll deal with that later. We'll deal with that later. Um. If y'all want to know anything that's going to go on, uh, these grain tanks here, we're probably going to end up, uh, selling them back. And we're going to make put them up over here, but might be something different. We'll work on there. Um, that's palletizer machine that's in here. That's in the uh, main farm. Let's see, we got our four down here ready to be loaded again. I need to just drop the trailer. Uh, our Wolverine. Having some work done to the head of it, uh, broke some teeth off of the cutting part. As soon as that fixed, we're going to drop this for us probably next episode or two, give or take. Oh, yeah, this is our wheat uh, that's left. We gotta get it up. I forgot all about it. So, hopefully, this augers still working right 
I didn't do nothing to it and it took the little piggyback trailer so we're going back up to it and I'm going to be totally yep I'm totally off Yeah, it's 24 minutes already. Good Lord, I was hoping we get um, that field harvest. Oh, 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 there's our sign, there's our sign. Here's a sign. All right, it's going into the tank. There's a hope it's now on the ground, so. I can't get out far enough to actually see it or can I? A little more, a little more, come on. Oh, it's not going to do it. But anyway, I'm not putting in those three quite yet. I'm just filling this one up. Uh, we're going to fill it up to its max. It'll be for the seed masters probably. We got 100,000 liters. Let's check out the, uh, the uh, yeah. We got 150,000 liters of wheat. Um, that canola needs to go down to the factories. Uh, check out the wood chips. And then check out the straw. 685,000 liters of straw down there, folks. Yeah. Quite a bit. Alright, this guy needs to go over main farm to north farm that's right folks it's going to the north farm to drive core stop at the last or um we got a field barley up there number nine is ours and if i'm not mistaken yep it's ready so is our canola so, uh, yeah. Seven stars ain't finished yet. He should have been finished by now. Oh, well. Let's see if we can catch our combine. All right. Made the first loop. Let's see. I'm going to put him on. Let's go on up and down. Should be able to work that out. But I'm going to do a jump cut right here. Uh, I know I got a few minutes in front of uh, what I had already. So I'm going to do a jump cut and come back when we're finished with this field. Hear that or you want me to just end the episode here and come back with the next episode leaving from here. I think that's what I'll do folks. I'm going to go ahead and say the goodbyes here. And then when we'll come back we'll, uh, next episode we'll be going to field 9. Or I'll have the combine already over on field nine and show y'all what barley we got off this field. So uh, that's that's all I do. So thank all y'all for coming out and watching. Um, I'm gonna cut it real short. So folks, I love each and every one of y'all. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I'll see y'all later.